the Fritz. Welcome to this segment called, You Know What Grinds My Gears? On today's segment, <laughs> I'm here with my friends Don't Man Down and Rachel. We're here at Walla Walla Point Park. Alright. <clears throat> you know what grinds my gears? And then you say, what? What? <laughs> it, people who do not put the shopping carts back in the corral after they're finished using them. You know how many times I've gone to the store after work and there are shopping carts uh, screw, uh, strewn about in the parking lot or even uh, in the aisles. Uh, like people don't care anymore. I don't, I don't understand this. I, why is it so hard to to to, to put you know, grab a, you grab the shopping cart and just scoot it right along and put it back by the front entrance with the other shopping carts or put it in the conveniently placed shopping corrals throughout the parking lot is it, 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 it's just so mind-boggling why is it so damn hard pardon my language but you know I sometimes I, I end up rounding uh, shopping carts even though that's not my job I don't work at the grocery store so why should I do that you know why should I clean up other people's uh, messes I, why? Why? Because I'm a good person? No, it's because, well, yeah, I'm a good person, but because but I don't want to hit one of those shopping carts or roll across the parking lot and hit my car. You know, I'd rather have those, uh, how are we doing, Danny? Are we still rolling? Yep. Okay, good. Uh, I'm sure I'm not the only person who's experienced uh, a shopping cart in a parking lot and you have to drive around it. Or you have to find a different parking spot because there's a shopping cart uh, uh, occupying uh, a prime space or it's just right over the line where you can't get your car in, in all the way without running uh, running a risk of hitting the the shopping cart and then you have to worry about someone else coming along and and, and uh, scraping scraping you or, or hitting your taillight or something like that thankfully that's never happened to me but I don't uh, uh, so that's what grinds my gears uh, does that grind your gears still man Dan or, or am I uh, in the minority here yeah sometimes Sometimes, oh, oh, sometimes, sometimes. Yeah, yeah. I, it, I, yeah, I figure I, I, I don't huh. have to go to the stores too often, so so mm. it, it, it hasn't bothered me as much as if I ah. have to go more often. Ah! Yeah, I usually go to the store uh, every other day and I just pick up one item. Or I go, I have to work sometimes, I get two items. So it's just a constant, because I work right next door to the grocery store. It's very convenient. I, and that store that I go to is open. Uh, when I get off work or before I go to work, I just swing by, get something, put it in the car, or if it's cold enough, warm enough, and I'll just leave it in there or I take it inside uh, to work, put it in the uh, break room and then take it out. So that works. That works pretty well. But that's just one thing I've, I've noticed as the days go by. It seems to be worse. Actually, it seems to be worse in the winter time than it is like spring and summer with the stray shopping carts. I think in the uh, spring and summer, the weather is better, so people are more inclined to actually push it back in, in where if it's really bad weather, people just tend to leave it right outside, right next to their car, so they don't have to worry about the ice or the snow or getting wet. They just leave it right out there, right in the middle of the, of the you-know-what parking lot. And they just uh, zip on by, like, hi, hi, da, 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 da. Uh, oh, uh, uh, how about uh, Rachel? Uh, does she get angry? Uh, I had uh, had to work one time, like a later shift, like almost a double. And one time it was, it, it got kind of breezy, and somebody didn't have it. A cart in the parking in the right spot. So when the wind blew, it hit my wind my window. Oh no! Oh, well, not my window, but my little mirror. So I had to replace my mirror. Oh wow! Mm -hmm. That costs money. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Oh, that's terrible. You had to pay for someone else's mis mistake. Yeah. Yeah. Don't you just hate that? I hate that. That makes me angry. I want to go. I'm going to have to cut that out. Wow. Thanks for joining. 
Thanks for joining us on this installment of You Know What Grinds My Gears with Mr. Fritz. Bye, everyone. Until next time, applesauce. Bye. Bye. Oh, wow. I'm a two-